My name is Brian C. Lee Jr. I am the principal of Colocate Design here in New Orleans, Louisiana. Colocate is a design justice architecture and design practice. Design justice, again, calls for us to seek racial, social, and cultural reparations through the process and outcomes of design. Land and buildings have always been used as a tool for segregation and separation. So our work really, really tries to focus on design as protest. So the Claiborne Innovation District, being this 19 block marketplace, was a direct response to over 50 years of organizing and advocacy uh, that really wanted to stitch a neighborhood back together and provide a vision for what a future of a community that had been torn apart by forces uh, beyond their control. I would point to the Paper Monuments Project, which is a citywide planning process in which we navigated critical conversation in this city around the removal of Confederate monuments across the city of New Orleans. Through that process, we talked not just to thousands of people, but we engaged with our public services and our public institutions, whether that was schools and libraries. We created 1,500 different proposals from people across the city. We produced uh, nearly 20,000 newspapers that reflected the voice of the people and sent that out across the city. There are a set of struggles that any organization based in a social justice mindset has to deal with. And uh, the biggest challenge is that we are up against systems that are entrenched, that are often based in white supremacy, based in patriarchy, based in evilism. And the principles that have been established over many, many years have to be deconstructed for the purposes of our work to be successful. And so not only do we have to design uh, beautiful spaces for people, but we actually have to think about how we deconstruct the, not just the mentality, uh, but the structures and systems and ordinances that continue to output the same set of violent acts in the built environment. So uh, I think the challenge really is one that is rooted in a long, long history of disenfranchisement and disinheritance. To win any award is a tremendous honor. I think as a practice, we set out to change the way the industry operates. So the recognition uh, allows us to continue to stand with our head high and to acknowledge the value in the work that we put in and gives us firm footing as we continue to build and design more spaces that serve more people across this country and hopefully do it for uh, generations to come. So very excited and very pleased that, that we were honored in this way.